2010 Toyota Corolla. Customer says the car is shaking and it won't go over 40 miles an hour. I plugged up a scan tool. I can tell right off what's going on. I'll show you. So I started it up. This is the misfire counters. And you can see we are counting up on cylinder three really bad. I can feel the car shaking. First thing I want to do is confirm it is cylinder three. And I'm going to use that through a pressure transducer in the tailpipe and sync it with the cylinder because sometimes these computers aren't always right and you'll put in the wrong spark plug or you'll put in the wrong part. So let's do that. As you can see, the VSC is blinking. The cylinders are counting up. And this is a good way to confirm you have a misfire. You can feel a pop in the exhaust. You can even hear it on camera. Pop, 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 pop. That's a dead miss right there. Let's figure it out. Okay, I got my Pico scope hooked up. Channel one is ignition trigger. Channel two is the pressure sensor. And it's hooked up to this wire to the tailpipe down here. And it will record, it'll record the pulses. So when there's a misfire, it'll catch it on the scope. It's really cool. This way we know which cylinder is misfiring. That's very important. Okay, I'm gonna start it up, start the scope, get the key. You can see the engine's shaking. See that shaking? Misfiring. Whoa, there it is. It's really plain to see. What a cool capture. Okay, we can clearly see the misfire. We can definitely see something's going on with the number three, because this is, you count over one, two, and start your count. One, it, this is the firing order, one, three, four, two. So you go over from, you go over two from your firing event, one, two, if it's a four cylinder, and you start your count, one, three. It's pushing pressure, there's definitely a misfire there, so we've confirmed that. I'll probably just swap the coils and plugs around real quick, because it's easy to get to, and see if it moves. So let's do that. Okay, I switched coil number three to one. This is the one that's misfiring. Let's roll the scope and see if it moves from here. Scope's rolling, start it up. definitely misfiring and yes it moved this is great so we just figured out what it was in a matter of minutes so I'll stop it that's so cool so it moved let's move our cursors or our phasers so one two we moved it cylinder number one so you start off you count one two and then this one is your first firing order. That's one, three. So when I move the coil, it moved over to three. This thing needs an ignition coil. We're gonna get an ignition coil and get this thing put in and get it fixed. All right, we got a brand new NGK coil and a new set of spark plugs. We're gonna put those in and we'll recheck, make sure this thing's fixed. All right, I'm on a test drive with this little Camry just to make sure it's not misfiring. And as you can see on the computer, kind of a glare, but zero misfires. It just needed a little bit of TLC. I noticed when I took the plugs out, the gap was really large. The spark plug has to jump a really large gap. It causes the coils to get hot. So it's got new plugs, hopefully, It'll make the other coils, the other three, last longer. Appreciate y'all watching. Catch y'all on the next one.